This season we've moved further away from the typical sitcom formula. I don't think we necessarily have, you know, the primary story, the secondary story, and da-da-da, and they wrap around each other, and one's about being married, and one's about being engaged. Like, we've kind of thrown that out the window at this point. I think now they're, like, in the actual relationship part of their relationship. We start where we left off, it's just sort of exploring these characters even more. Some of the jokes this year are about me at work and what's it like because I'm an authority figure. So I get to hire a new assistant, and... I said, let's go look at the casting couch, because I think it's all girls, but it's not. Dude, what's with the meat locker? And so I have to hire a guy, so I just grab the first one. I say, I go, whatever, I don't know what to do with a guy. Just come in. Dunbar, it's an honor to meet you. Here's my resume and your bagel. Mm. Timmy, huh? Did that bagel hit the ground? No, just me. Great, you're hired. It's just a funny guy to play off of because he's from Harvard and he's super smart and he's basically my lackey. It's not an especially comforting uh, life for Timmy at the moment. In fact, it's one of uh, great stress and duress uh, and Timmy, as it stands, is barely keeping it together. I mean, you're clearly, clearly taking advantage of me. And Russell just gets him to do these insane, insane crazy yeah. things. Bond. James Bond. <laughs> Never gets old. The opportunity to work with a co comedy veteran and really be able to learn from him on a day-to-day -day basis was, was a huge motivation and incredibly appealing to me. Sometimes you're going to be in movies or TV shows where you click with people and sometimes you don't. And I think that when you actually do find like a common ground and a bond outside of this, this stage here, it just helps tremendously with what you do on the stage. We all get along really great. We have a lot of fun and uh, it's really well written now. <sighs> Okay. All right, one, two, three. Uh, am I skipping? Not feeling it today? Uh, I felt it a little. Anytime you watch a show and there's that chemistry and the kind of dialogue that I think the writers bring to it and, and, and hopefully what we the cast bring to it is, uh, is what makes any show worth watching. And the show's going in the right direction, not in a lazy one, because sometimes sitcoms kind of start to just relax and then, ha ha, you say this, it'll get a laugh. But we're actually trying to be clever and keep it moving, so I like that.